we're hooked up with the first fish of the day. Literally just got here. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. Whoa. I was just throwing on the curly tail under this dock and I was like, there's gotta be a fish. And oh my God, it's a smallmouth. Didn't even know what it would be. Oh my God, it's the most caught up smallmouth I've ever seen. Folks, do you see this right now? Holy smokes, guys. I was literally just walking, walking along this dock and this guy just came and smoked it. He's not huge, but still fascinating. Wow, unbelievable. Absolutely crazy, folks. Literally just got here. Just was walking it along this little like dock thing and this smallie just came and just thrashed it. Oh my God. It's too bad they're out of season, but <laughs> I got him on his little curly tail, man. Good morning, folks. How you guys doing? And welcome back to another episode. As you guys saw from the first clip in this video, I caught a accidental smallmouth bass on May 16th, 2021. Um, yeah, I was just kind of walking a curly tail um, aimlessly, wasn't really thinking about anything or what I would catch. And yeah, as you guys saw, I accidentally caught that smallmouth. Now, unfortunately that fish was out of season, but um, they're not out of season anymore. Today or yesterday, July 3rd, uh, was bass opener or smallmouth bass opener in my region. And uh, using the knowledge that I obtained from accidentally catching that bass back in May, I decided to venture over to that exact dock um, on opener uh, yesterday and actually try to catch them like properly, you know, because I mean, yeah, now I can actually fish for them. So that is exactly what I did. And it was a pretty successful day. Um, I don't know. I had fun. I got some good fish and I'm just going to kind of leave it at that, guys. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Um, you know, yeah, I, I, I just kind of took the knowledge, the accidental knowledge I obtained and I used it to, on opener, which is awesome. So. Anyways, guys, I'm, 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 I'm happy with how this video went, and uh, it's all done, or most of it is done on that exact dock. So uh, that was why I showed you guys that first fish, just for, I guess, dramatic effect-ish, kind of. And it, anyways, <laughs> anyways, I will see you guys on the water. up with our first fish of the day it is a nice smallmouth first bass of the open season of the year and there's like six more down there as well holy cow welcome to bass season 2021 holy smokes there's like five look at them. look at them all down there there's like five of them down there this could be a stupidly good day wow first fish of the day. That is freaking awesome. Probably like a four pounder, maybe a three, maybe a three pounder. Beauty bass though, not even gonna lie. Get in here, bud. You gotta be kidding me, folks. First freaking bass of opener season 20, uh, 2021. <laughs> freaking crazy. Oh, he's got my thing. Let it go, bud. Holy smokes, guys. Quick picture and we're gonna get him back. It's beauty. An absolute beauty of a bass. Just gonna get my curly tail out of his mouth. There we go. Alright folks. First bass of the day. Look at that folks. There he goes, back down to the depths. Alright, so folks, kinda what I'm doing here is just kinda just kinda walking it along the um, the dock here. Oh yeah, this is like the first day bass were open in 2021 in my region. So I'm kind of just having having fun with it. Uh, throwing a curly tail. We'll see if there's any more down here willing to bite. I'm sure there is. Holy cow, folks, second bass of the day. This is a giant. Second one of the day, and it's absolutely huge. Wasn't even paying attention. Oh my God, it is huge, guys. Second fish of the day. Holy cow. What did I tell you about this day being stupid? Oh my God. Are you kidding me? Oh my God.
So we got people docking their sea here. Also got the biggest smallmouth of my life. Oh my god. Whoa. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Sorry guys. Okay. Holy crap. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, holy. Come on, bud. Oh my gosh. Come on, come on. Oh my gosh. Folks, this thing does not want to be landed. Oh, come on, come on. Oh my god. Got him, folks. Holy cow. That has to be the biggest bass of my life. You gotta be kidding me. Holy cow. Folks, I cannot believe this right now. Oh my gosh. Look at that bass. Look at that bass. All right, so folks. This is a 19, a 19 inch smallmouth bass. 19 inches. Unbelievable fish. Unbelievable. There he goes. All right, folks, the GoPro's dead, but we just got our third of the day. It's getting dark. I didn't really vlog too well today, but yeah, I went to my buddy's house and I decided that I wanted to uh, come back here later in the day and we got our third smallie of the day. It's actually kind of kind of a good one. It actually is a good one. Come here, bud. Whoa. <laughs> Tough little landing job there with the, uh, with the phone in hand, but there we go, folks. This guy just throttled it. It's freaking awesome. Third smallie of the day. It's kind of got a weird, a weird lip there, but I'm not gonna complain. Oh, he's really messed up in the lip there. Gonna let him go. This is the the bridge of destiny, honestly. Love it. Okay, so uh, so folks, that is the conclusion of a bass or smallmouth bass opener 2021. I caught three bass in this video, or three bass on the opener. It was a pretty solid day, especially for only fishing that one spot. And uh, it was fun, honestly. That, that second small I caught was, was pretty solid. It was pretty big, probably around four pounds. Um, it's, it definitely wasn't the biggest small month of my life. I was being over exaggerative in the video, but I was really excited. But anyways, guys, that was a nice, a nice fish. And uh, although, since we only caught three fish in this video, I'd like to include one more fish. Um, and this is actually from opener last year. I found this video on my phone and for some reason it never made YouTube. But it's this video of me catching a smallmouth um, back in June of last year because the, the opener was actually uh, earlier. Uh, the regs changed this year, so they kind of push opener back for smallmouth. But anyways, last year, fishing the same spot, on opener, I had this video and um, I, I, it was me catching a smallmouth. And um, it was off a of bed. I don't know how you guys feel about that. I, I was allowed, it was legal, obviously, that they were open. Um, so I, I was just kind of pitching... Uh, pitching a swim bait to it at first and I pitched a little craw to it and I ended up catching it and it's really cool footage because uh, my stepdad is actually filming for me in this video and it's an, he has an overhead view of the bed and you can actually see it uh, striking and all that so I don't know I found that pretty cool so uh, yeah guys I'm gonna throw that at the end of this video because there's only one uh, or only three good smallmouth in the video and I'd like to, there to be one more fish and uh, yeah I'm gonna end the video here though for you seeing me I'm gonna say bye and I'll, and I'll end the actual video on that clip. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you on the next one. And uh, enjoy, enjoy this clip. Oh God. Feeling lucky this time, Ken. <laughs> he totally went away. He had no interest that time. This is a mediocre lure for a bedding bass. Not really that good. Oh, you had to pay off. Dang. You gotta commit to it. It's like it's like a, like a full time job, man. Oh. 
Oh, he has it. Look, he has it in his mouth. Yeah, he does. See, he has it. Oh, that, oh I hope we got this on video. That'd be Damn so it. cool. There, you got him. All right, folks. Check this smallmouth out. 17 inch here, probably about a three pounder. <laughs> that was awesome.